The Hollywood Writers Union says its members can return to work on Wednesday after it struck a tentative deal with major studios. The Writers Guild of America also voted to end the 148-day strike that has lasted since May. The union's over 10,000 members have yet to ratify a new three-year contract. They have until October 9th to vote on it, but for now, they can get back to work. The new terms include pay raises, increased health and pensions contributions, as well as safeguards against the use of artificial intelligence. Under the deal, AI cannot be used to undermine a writer's credit. Writers can choose to use AI when drafting scripts, but a company cannot require the use of the software. The studio must also disclose to a writer if any materials were generated by AI. The end of the protests means daytime and late-night talk shows can return to air. However, it doesn't signal a return to normal for Hollywood just yet. That's right. We want a contract. The SEG after Actors Union remains on strike. However, those on the picket line were hopeful following the news of a tentative writer's deal. I hear it's an exceptional deal, and uh, historically, whatever deal they give to one union, the uh, next union kind of uses as a template for their own deal. We were just discussing how between that moment and the ratification, we need to be extremely vigilant to make sure everything that we're asking for actually says what it means in the contract, and uh, SAG should follow suit. While one strike may be nearing an end, another is looming. Voice actors and motion capture performers in the multi-billion dollar video game industry will go on strike if negotiations on the new labor contract that were set to begin on Tuesday fail.